All right, YouTubers, welcome to the channel. BTG, AKA Bust 'em Guns. We're a new channel, getting up and running. Uh, we've put a couple of teasers out there, a couple of shorts, uh, just to kind of break the ice. This will be the first full review. I guess we can call this a semi-custom unboxing. Uh, this is my Icarus, 3, Icarus frame. Uh, Ace 360 SOCOM, uh, based on the SIG 320 platform. Uh, it's a pretty nice setup, aluminum frame, nine millimeter. Uh, let's go ahead and break it out so we can get a little closer look at it. A couple of magazines, got some options here. Get that out and let's put this to the side. For this particular setup, well, let's go ahead and clear the gun first. Gun's empty. Nothing in the bottom. Magazine's empty. Find a safe direction. Move the magazine back in for aesthetics. So this here is uh, my version of a custom SIG P320. The frame is Icarus Precision. It's the company that makes the frame. Uh, this is their Ace 360 SOCOM. This is a full size frame. Uh, they do different sizes. They do different types. They do frames for Glocks. They do frames for uh, the SIG 365. So they got a real nice setup over there, different colors. This here is their fire bronze color. It also comes in black. Uh, I like the fire bronze. Uh, the top end, it's pretty much killer innovations. So the slide itself, this is uh, the P320 compact slide. Uh, the barrel is also killer innovation and it's the 3.9 inch and the compensator as well is killer innovation. Uh, you got your option of colors to slide, you can get in black. It also comes in gray. The barrel, you can get in either gold, you can get it in gray or you can get it in black. Uh, as far as the comp, that's going to either be gold or black. That's your only two options there. Uh, the comp is adjustable. It comes with a little tool, a little lug, where you can adjust the amount of compensation that you want. So you can adjust that in and out depending on your needs. The slide's going to come stripped down. So they've got two different versions. This is the Velocity V1. Uh, they've got a V2 that's a slightly different design. Uh, I like the V1, it's got more cutouts, so I like the cutouts on the top. It's got the lightning cuts on the side, so I like that particular look. Uh, it's got the optic cut, so it's actually cut for an RMR footprint. Uh, it comes with the plate on there. The plate's got a nice design, colored screws. You can get black or you can get the blue, whatever you prefer. Uh, sights, your choice. I went with the uh, Fusion night sights on here. Uh, as far as the spring kit, they sell a spring kit on there. You can go with their spring kit. If you got a preference, uh, you can get the spring kit off SIG's website. Uh, or you can, any site, different sites sell the spring kits for them for the 320 slide. So that's your preference there. Uh, as far as the other hardware, gas pedal. I went with the uh, Tyrant design. Uh, I like that look. Uh, it's not too overbearing. Uh, there's another one. I had it in gold. But as far as accents against the frame, I think the black looks better. So I went with the black. Uh, but I did do the gold for the back plate. So that's Tyrant design as well. Back plate on there. Uh, I went with the extended mag release. That's Tyrant design. Went with the black on that. Uh, fire control system. This is the Custom Works. Six Custom Work fire control unit. But I did switch out the trigger shoe to the Tyrant design trigger shoe. So you can get the black and gold accent. It's got the line in the front. The back has got the chevrons to uh, get a picture of that. It's got the chevrons in the back to match the tyrant design look. So you can see those back there. So nice contrast. So it, it just gave it a real nice look. Uh, magazines, I mean, your choice. I got the SIG. I just bought some back plates, switched the back plate to the gold. So that's kind of a clean look if you don't want too much extended out. Uh, but I do have. Another base place, this is the Tyrant Design. That's the plus five. 
So you get the plus five base plates. Uh, when you look at these on the website on Tyrant Design, they tell you that it won't work with the Icarus frame without modifying the frame. Uh, I bought it anyway just to try it. I didn't really have any intentions on modifying the frame, but it fit in there nice with no modification. So I guess it's a hit and miss. Uh, I've got another one that's black. Uh, it doesn't just snap right in, but if you put a little pressure on it, it will lock. And that's with no modifications. So although the website says they don't work with the Icarus frames, uh, mine work just fine. And it's not a lot of pressure to get that to lock and put it in there. Just a little more pressure than normal, it still locks. So good to go there. Uh, other base plates, this is uh, 21, that's for my uh, Lesion. It's got the um, Strike Industry base plate on it, which that's nice. Uh, a little more open look, you got a little more space around it. I don't particularly care for that look there, but it's personal preference. If you like that look, you can go with the Strike Industries. Uh, they've got some different colors on that. Uh, even on this... Uh, Tyra design. These come in different colors. Uh, they've got a gray. Uh, they definitely got the gold. I think they got some red, but uh, the gold was more of a fit just to accent with the slide in the barrel. Uh, but these, like I say, if you're going to match it up, if you're looking for this look here, you want to go with the compact slide because this slide comes in compact and it also comes in full size. So it's your preference. It comes in black and it comes in gray. So you can get whichever look. It's kind of like a a dark gunmetal gray, but uh, real nice setup. Kill Innovation, they've got some nice products over there, so check them out if you're not familiar with them. Uh, but this is a real nice piece. I like the way it turned out a lot. The aesthetics, the look, it looks nice. And as far as the color, your color combination, that's personal preference. It's got a real nice beaver tail on it, so that's nice, but yeah, this came out real nice. Uh, if you haven't checked out Icarus Precision, definitely check them out. They've got real nice, and they've got a whole list of slides over there for the P365, all different styles. They've got magazines to go with them, base plates. You can pick and choose. They've got them for the Glocks, so yeah, you won't be disappointed. The RMR plates. Uh, this is the black plate, but they got the plates in different colors. So if you want, they actually have it in gold. If you want the gold plate, you can get the gold. Uh, I was good with the black. I like the design. I don't think I'm going to put an optic on it. Uh, I like the sleek look. Uh, I like shooting with the iron sights. Uh, the night sights uh, are nice. Let's see if I can get you a picture there. Yeah, so. Yeah, the night sights are nice. So easy sight picture. Uh, I don't mind the dots on the back. Uh, I start to go with black. I ordered a different sight for another gun. I went with the black for the back uh, so it wouldn't stand out as much. Still night sights, but without the wider rim. So I'll probably black that out with a marker or some. But uh, overall, extremely pleased with this. But, uh, that's it. This is the uh, first full video of the channel. Uh, more to come. You know, we're going to be featuring little bit of shooting here and there it's going to be mainly reveals initially just kind of rolling out some of what's in the collection uh got some pretty nice pieces or nice in my opinion uh, you guys can be the judge of that but um this is it for now on this piece uh i will get some range footage at some point and get back to it but uh for now thanks for tuning in support the channel uh, appreciate a like subscribe it's going to be more to come uh btg bust them guns out for now